Understanding the word, terrified, a comprehensive guide. Hello, everyone. Welcome back to our English language learning channel. Today, we are going to dive deep into a very expressive word, terrified. By the end of this video, you'll understand exactly what it means, how to use it, and you'll be able to add it to your vocabulary to express intense feelings of fear. So, let's get started. Terrified is an adjective that describes an extremely strong feeling of fear. It's much more intense than just being scared or afraid. When someone is terrified, they are so frightened that it might be hard for them to think or act normally. For example, she was terrified when she saw the snake in her backyard. He's terrified of heights, so he avoids tall buildings. In these examples, terrified shows a high level of fear, more than just being a little scared. You can use terrified in a few different ways. It's commonly used to describe someone's feelings in the moment, but it can also be used to talk about a general state of fear. In the moment, when the lights went out suddenly, we were all terrified. He was terrified when he realized he was lost. General state of fear. She is terrified of spiders, even the tiny ones. I am terrified of flying, so I take the train whenever possible. To help you better understand terrified, let's look at some synonyms and antonyms. Synonyms, words with similar meaning, petrified, frightened, scared, stiff, horror struck. Antonyms, words with opposite meaning, fearless, unafraid, brave, calm. Since we're focusing on meaning and usage today, I won't go into phonetic transcriptions. However, you can practice saying the word after me, terrified. And that's it for today's lesson. I hope you now feel confident using the word terrified and understanding its meaning. Remember, learning a new language is all about practice, so try using terrified in your own sentences and conversations. Thank you for watching and see you in the next video.